Hey guys, it's Smell Productions, and welcome to a new mini series for the Pokemon Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire special demo version. So, yes, it's been a while since I've done a few videos and other stuff like that. Part of it was because that of school. The next portion was that I was sick. And the time I found out I was sick, it really wasn't sickness. I mean, it wasn't a cold, which I thought it was. It turned out to be allergies, and I've been on medication for a couple weeks trying to, you know, reduce all the cold symptoms, and they weren't helping. And, uh, yeah, I just started getting into some allergy medicine, and, you know, I'm back into it. So, let's get this thing going. By all means, I still have a little bit of symptoms for my cold, not cold, uh, allergies, but it's not bad. So, it's good enough to do a video series. So, anyways, to pick our language here, we'll go with English, and we'll begin our game. Here we are, the special demo version. And it looks like we start off with the Latios here. So that's quite interesting. And that is pretty cool how they show this little cutscene here. I just recently saw the new trailer. It looks like you can fly, just like you can actually fly in the game, which is pretty cool. Unless I interpreted that wrong, but uh, it still is pretty sweet. But anyways, Steven, we have made it. Thank you, Latios. You helped immensely. Okay, it does not sound like a Latios, but whatever. This is Mazdeep Deep City. This is a town where scientists work day and night to unresearch, aiming to reach great expanse of space. I received a message from a professor I know asking if we could come and help him. It seems like that rather bad people have been trying to steal his research results for themselves. We should hurry to the Space Center at once. Come with me, Orlando! As you can tell, the graphics look pretty sweet. A huge improvement toward, like, comparing it to the Game Boy version. Game Boy Advance. This is the Space Center. The professor should be with... Oh, why don't you look at that? Team Aqua. Grr! Troublemaker spotted! You're planning on getting in the way of us Team Aqua members, aren't you? But we won't hold back, not even if that one's a kid and you happen to totally be my ideal type of guy. Oh, huh, well you put it that way then, it looks like though we have little choice. We'll have to battle our way through this. Orlando, would you let me your strength? I'd like you to battle alongside me and my Pokemon. If you agree, then choose from these three Pokeballs. Select the Pokemon that you want on your side in battle. Alright, so let's see. It looks like we have the choice of Combuskin, Grovile, or Marstomp. I would normally choose Combuskin, but since it was in Pokemon X and Y, I really don't want to use that. And yeah, I'm sure that we're going to use Megas here to show them off. So rather if I want Marstomp or Grovile. You know, I want to see the Grovile Mega Evolution. So most likely we'll use it. Alright, here we go. So we are challenged by the Team Aqua Grunt, and he sends out a Poochiena. And what level is this thing? Since we're Mazzy we have to be around level 30. 35. Okay. Poochiena level 30? Come on. I know they're trying to make it easy for the demo, so it's easy to get through, but still. Alright, so let's just go for a Leaf Blade. And alright, there goes that Poochiena. Pretty easily, at least. And we defeat the Grunt. Whoa, I got defeated all too soon. Heh <laughs> it doesn't matter if you get us now. You're already too late. We, Team Aqua, have already figured out where to find that mega-evolving Pokemon. All right, time, to us, time for us to set sail for that island. What island? And there's some professor dude. My goodness! If it isn't young Steven, so you keep my rescue as asked. Well, I thank you for that. No need to thank me. I was not alone. This is Orlando. You helped me battle those thugs. Together we set them running. Indeed, indeed. I owe you as well, Orlando. I'm sure we have to thank you for we have to thank for no one's getting hurt. However, it appears that the situation's already desperate. That team something or other who was just here just stole some of our findings about Mega Evolution. They have even learned the location of a certain Pokemon that's capable of Mega Evolution. I'm afraid the Pokemon will be captured by these criminally inclined wretches. I see. That's nothing that we can ignore. 
Orlando, I have a favor to ask. Please come with me. Come and help me protect the Pokemon from these thieves. Alright, let's go. I've gotten the coordinates from my professor, so now I know which direction to go. As soon as you feel ready, speak with me. Yes, I will speak with you. I am ready. Actually, I want to explore. I want to explore. What's going on here, Maz Deep? Big Brother Earl, I need Mr. Manager, thank you for all that you taught me. I'll carry on your lecture for new trainers and pride, just like as you taught me, Mr. Manager. Okay, let's talk to this guy. Little brother, no, our, I mean, trusty employee. You may, you may be going to Odale Town now, but I hope you'll carry on and give the lecture to any new trainers you meet there. Oh, so you'll see us earlier. Uh, at least when the game comes out. That's pretty nice. And I like what they did there. So anyways, let's explore this house. Okay, it looks like the door's locked. I'm assuming all the doors will be locked, but we'll check anyways. Yes, the door's locked. The guy who lives in that house, Steven, is giving me weird stones. Is collecting rocks really all that fun? I don't get it. What in the world? There's something here. I can't see anything. I can't get into Steven Stone's house. Is this some kind of Pokemon trick? Whoa. There's an invisible obstacle in your way. We need the self scope! But no, we don't have that, so. Door is locked. Is there anything else? The gym. Tate and Liza. No, no, no. You can't go in. Alright, I guess our only thing that we can do is go through here. But first, let's look at the bottom screen. It looks like they have a Buzz Nav. I'm assuming that's the new Poke Nav. It has Pokemon news and stuff. And there's a Pokemon party thing at the bottom. Actually, let's look at the Pokemon summary page. Let's see if there's anything special. Alright, looks like we got a crappy nature. But that's okay. And we got him in uh, Maz Deep City. He likes to run. That's great. And we'll check out... Let's see. What is this? The bag? Do we have anything? Okay, we got a Hyper Potion. Three of them. Three full heals. Okay. And we got nothing. No TMs or HMs. So we're basically stuck here. Unless this guy escorts me home. Alright, so let's go. We are ready. Let's go help that Pokemon. Because we have no other choice. Because we can't get out of here. And once again, we're using Latios to head towards the island. <laughs> All right. And I don't get how he summons him. Does he have like a special little, I don't know, whistle? Like he, like in Avatar The Last Airbender for Appa? No, I don't know. But anyways... I I expect Team Magma and Team Aqua have beat us here in search for that Pokemon. Orlando, can I ask you to start looking around? I'm sure there'll be full these uh, those full teams will be around here somewhere. If you step in tall grass here, wild Pokemon may attack you. Make sure you're ready for them. All right, well, let's run through. I want to see. I want to hear the wild battle theme. Oh yeah, I'm feeling it. The nostalgia. Oh boy. Oh, that sounds good. Alright. The trumpets. Can't go without the trumpets at third gen. Alright, so it looks like this lining is going to be pretty easy to take down. I guess it'll be a little bit harder than that Poochiena at level 30. But whatever. Oh, that sounds so nice. I probably should have just stayed here just to listen to it. Oh, well. I'll probably hear it more, because I heard that there's more, like, days. Like, every day there could be something, like, a new quest or something. And then at some point we could actually transfer them to the final game. Like, you get special Pokemon, special items. And I guess I'll be going through all the days. I think I'm, if I, I know I'm a bunch behind, so I'm, I know there'll be days that are stacked up behind this. So I'll separate this into different parts. At least that's what I think I'll do. But anyways, let's go over here. Ridiculous. No one has warned me about this. To think that Team Aqua would have showed up looking for that Mega Evolving Pokemon and that girl just now. Why is that strong trainer like her here? Oh, what should we do? Oh, Wibble. What are you acting so afraid for? We got nothing to worry about. We got our team, our admin Tabitha. Huh? Gah! More interference? D -d Darn it! Why does everyone keep wanting to get in Team Magma's way? I, I won't even get away with it. All right, let's go. It looks like there's 3D here. Uh, yeah, there is a little bit. And it looks like 
it does oh yeah it does shift a little bit when I go on 3D. Let's see how it looks in 3D. Oh I like the detail of the background. That's pretty nice. But I got a bad matchup here. I just I'm just gonna go for the aerial ace. That should do a lot of damage. But yeah, that the background it does look really good. That's what I have to say. I mean in Pokemon X and Y it was kind of limited. But yeah, they added the extra effects, it makes it look real good. Very good improvements. But anyways, I'll switch back to 2D. Well, alright, we defeat that grunt. What? I lost! Yeah, you lost, because you suck. Ridiculous, no one's warning me about this. No one told me that you'd be strong, Wibble. Hee hee hee, not too bad for a little kid. Fine, an ace grunt like me will take care of you in the flashiest of flashes. And that pose, though. <laughs> yeah, look at that. Same pose, exactly. Okay, let's go. There's a Nummel. Once again, a terrible matchup. But that's okay. I'll just go for the Leaf Blade, since it is neutral, after all. Plus, it stabs, so... We should be okay. There we go. And it looks like we get to level 36, which means that we turn it into a Skeptile. Woo! Huh? I lost? Yeah, because you sucked. And I hate it how they, like... Like, in the previous games, all the trainers would say, like, Oh, I lost. Seriously, give up something interesting to say. I mean, they got better in the recent generations. I know this is a demo, so it really doesn't matter. But hopefully this is not a reoccurring theme, you know? Congratulations, you're Grove Wild involved in the Skeptile! What do you mean that you're not Team Aqua? Huh? You're here to protect the app Pokemon? Now that you mentioned it, the girl that beat us before was saying the assembly like that. Sheesh! Somebody sure does get excited when it's Mega Evolving Pokemon, huh? Yes, it is. Oh, look, it's May. You jerks! You think a two-on-one is a fair battle? And you call us and you call yourselves adults too. Never mind, you you wear outfits and those stripes. Uh are we being unfair? Do I really look weird? You nitwit, why are you acting so shocked? It's fine, we and Team Aqua do what we must do in order to keep to help Pokemon, right? That means that we can be unfair or, or as bad as we have to be. And I don't care about you, I totally rock my uniform. Do you see this midriff? I got more style than I know what to do with. Ooh. Ha! Orlando, what are you doing here? What? Another brat? Fine then, I'll show you why people compare us to Team Aqua with the mighty Poseidon. I'll take you on mano a mano. Yeah, hand in hand. Fair and square! All right. Team Aqua Grunt's gonna send out Poochyena. Go, Skeptile! Alright, let's see. Let's go for that Leaf Blade. I think that will be a good move here. And that's definitely gonna be a one hit KO. And a critical hit! It probably didn't matter at all. Grr, I lost it! Maybe mano a mano wasn't such a hot idea. Ah, uh, you know what? You're pathetic. Fine. I ranked at 25th highest grunt and Team Aqua will clean up this mess for you in no time. Oh yeah? How many are in your group? 25? <laughs> Alright, here is Team Aqua Grunts, number two, and she has a Karana. Finally, a good matchup. Alright, so let's go for that Leaf Blade. We're gonna get that rough skin, but that's okay. But we defeat the Team Aqua Grunt. So as far as this goes, it seems like Team Aqua and Team Magma have teamed up. Huh. Interest. I think you'd be so good at drawing out your own Pokemon's power. I'll be listing your name in our notebook of trouble troublesome opponents after this, so beware. Thanks for helping me out, Orlando. Oh, your Pokemon looks a little bit tired, though. Let me heal it up right away. Okay, thanks, even though I didn't really need it. 
There, ready for action. My dad asked me to come up to this island to survey some Pokemon that supposedly live here. And all these weirdos decked it out in red and blue trying to go after the local Pokemon. I just couldn't stand here and watch, you know. But there's a couple of guys ahead who seem way stronger than the two we just faced. I guess they're the bosses or something. I tried to fight them, but me and my team didn't stand a chance. Me you're a Pokemon Orlando, you might be able to win. There, I couldn't. Don't push you too hard, though. Cross your, cross your heart, okay? <laughs> so there you go. That tells us. Exactly. They're teaming up. I wonder if they'll be in uh, Omega Ruby Alpha Sapphire. That'd be quite a way to make a little bit of a change. But, let's go. <laughs> you there, oversized brutes, clear the path. We, the mighty Team Magma, will be the ones to obtain the Mega Evolving Pokemon. Whoa, ha, ha, ha. You know what? You got screw loose or something? Look at you, little Makuhita man. <laughs> He's a Makuhita man. Wow, wow, I would have been so humiliated. You compare me, Tabitha, the next chief of admin of Team Magma, to a Makahita? You better at least make me a Hariyama. <laughs> you're pretty funny, little man. I love funny, interested dudes. That's why I love you, bro, Archie. That's it, bro. Let's smash it out with a battle. I'm gonna love you to bits. I don't understand this brute at all. Frightening. It looks like, though, I have no choice. I'll give you a taste of what overwhelming power of an admin wields. Oh, ho sounds pretty fun. Come at me, little man. Whoa? Huh? Eh? Who is this? <laughs> See, like the child's here getting our way. It seems like there's no time for me to be picking fights with oversized brutes. My friend, I suggest that we call a temporary truce. Let's work together to wipe out this meddling child. Oh, good idea, bro. This is my funny little man. You, me, and our Pokemon are going to have a real good time later. No hold barred barrage, bro. Ho, ho, ha, ha. This one's proving to be quite a handful. Let's crush this impotent child. Ah, oh, good kid, let's rough you up real nice. Orlando. I'm sorry it took me so long, Orlando. And now I see what we have here. There are some types of bosses of the Team Magma and Team Aqua. I admit, I'm a bit surprised to see them joining forces. It matters little. We'll battle together, Orlando. Before we do, though, let me teach your skeptile a little something. And we forgot, we forgot how to use agility and learn frenzy play. And this is for you. All right. We got the mega bracelet. And it's our key items pocket. The mega bracelet I just gave you is a set of mysterious stones known as the keystone. It's a stone with your powers that bind you and your Pokemon together. Ah, uh, yes. We should give you our Skeptile this to hold as well. And we gave the Skeptile a Skeptile, uh, Skeptile to hold. I don't know what it said. But with the Keystone you hold, the Megastone uh, Skeptile uh, becomes the bonds that tie to you together. Now, allow you to draw forth the great power of Mega Evolution. Do you feel like it's a time to test your power? <laughs> I pray you don't underestimate me. I've been Tadifa Tabitha of Team Magma or something, and hoo -ha. You two look pretty fun too. I'm going to enjoy bubbling you. All right. You are challenged by Madmin, Admin Tabitha and Matt. And they're going to set out Cave Rupt and Sharpedo. Now, this is getting a little bit crazy. Let's go, Skeptile. Go, Metagross. Okay. This is what I think I should do. I should Mega Evolve. I don't know if I want a Frenzy Plant. Because I know I can take down the Sharpedo with one Leaf Blade. I'll do that to... I'll do a Frenzy Plant on that Cave Rupt. Because why not? But let's see this Mega Evolution. Oh boy, it's been a while since I've seen that Mega. Because I haven't been looking at the Pokemon news lately. Oh, the Mega Stick Pin. And it becomes... Something even more ferocious than our original Mega Metagross. So that Leaf Blade's going to definitely do a lot of damage to that Sharpedo. That's going down. Rough skin, I don't care. And we'll see what the Skepti... Uh, not Skeptile, uh, Cave Rupt is going to do. And Zen Headbutt. That's going to do a lot of damage. And I like this remix of the theme. It's very nice. But we defeat the Admins. Huh? Oh no, that's a loss I can be proud of. Aha, how could this be? For an Admin like me to lose to some so child and civil-haired pretty boy. 
My evaluation from leader Maxi will surely go down if he learns of this. Oh, your fellows are strong. I can't get enough of you. Remember this, child. You there, pretty boy. Someday I'll pay you back for this. <laughs> Looking forward to seeing you again. Good work, Orlando. That was a perfect big evolution. It, it was such strength, even though this was your first time using it in battle. I'm practically trembling with the excitement and that limitless, limitless potential I sense in you. What do you think of my Metagross? Its rugged white body is so cool to touch. Its beauty grows with the Mega Evolution. Yes, I think the day may come when I will be able to trust this Metagross to you. But now, we have scared off the crook, so shall we go and meet the Pokemon said to be cap capable of Mega Evolution? <laughs> Alright, let's go. Alright, so we're going to have to go all the way around. Now, let's see if I can get out. Okay, good. No wild encounters. And we'll head through this little path here. And, alright, here's Steven. There you are, Orlando. Seems like the mega evolving Pokemon is in that tall grass there. If you were to face it, man, I might accept you as well. Here you go. Throw a Pokeball and try to catch that Pokemon. Will we have a 100% catch rate? Or no? I guess we'll find out. I should test it. So let's see. Oh, a Glalie. Okay. Cool. So it's a mega evolution for that. Um, you know what? I'm gonna try throwing a Pokeball at it right now, see if it's a 100% catch rate. I mean, we got five of them, so it's not that big of a deal. So let's go! Pokeball, go! One. Two. Three. Yeah, it's 100% catch rate. <laughs> Yeah, but okay, that's fine. And Skeptile's level 37. So that was good. Did I give a nickname to Glalie? Ah, uh, not quite. Sorry. The Pokemon seem accepted. Seem to accept you after the performance in battle. Huh, seems to hold a Megastone. I wonder what powers it might be revealed if it mega evolves. You will see it yourself when you next battle. I envy you, Orlando. All right. Well then, I suppose it's time we return back to Ma's Deep City. Oh, that's such a good view. Thank you, Orlando. You'll find that there are many more Pokemon in the Hoenn region capable of Mega Evolution, including the one that we just recently met. And another possible form of ev evolution, though lost since incredibly ancient times, they might even exceed Mega Evolution, yes, Primal Reversion. Team Magma, Team Aqua, maybe after that power. The world still holds many mysteries and surprises that we can imagine. I wonder what you and your team will see, what you feel in a world like that. I wonder how you'll grow and change. No word words can describe how exciting this will be. I will say goodbye to you for now, Orlando. I'll be waiting eagerly for the day when, when I meet you and your Pokemon again. Alright. So we see a little bit more gameplay here. Oh, there's Wally, Steven, Archie, and uh, the other guy. <laughs> I forgot his name. Sorry. <laughs> Archie and oh my gosh, how could I not remember his name? I'm I'm seriously disappointed right now. I'll probably put it in an annotation or something. But anyways, that's that's it for the first episode of this little mini series. So if you enjoyed this episode, please leave a like, leave a comment, subscribe, jump in the inbox, and see you guys next time for some more Pokemon Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire special demo version.